Ole, 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 and welcome to All Your Living Needs. I'm your host, Jono, and this is the predictions for Portland Timbers versus Seattle Sounders, taking place Sunday, August 24th, 5 p.m. Previous uh, meets have shown Portland win three, lose one, and tie one. The season goal leaders of uh, Portland Timbers have Maximiliano Arutu, Aruti uh, with eight goals, Diego Valeri with seven goals, Gaston Fernandez with six goals, and Will Johnson with six goals. Seattle Sounders have Clint Dempsey with nine goals, Obafemi Martins with eight goals, and Chad Barrett with six goals. The Portland Timbers have played 24, Seattle Sounders have played 23. The Portland Timbers have won seven, and Seattle has won 13. The Portland Timbers have lost seven, and so have the Seattle Sounders. The uh, Portland Timbers have drawn ten, and the Seattle Sounders have drawn three. The Portland Timbers tied with New England Revolution one-to-one on Saturday. Portland let one go to Charlie Davis in the 26th minute, and the Timbers' defeat was to blame for that. Diego Valeri had an excellent chance in the 36th minute, but the shot went wide. Portland finally got their chance after the break when Liam Ridgewell scored on what looked like a sleeping revolution in the, 20, in the 64th minute. The Timbers continued their attack with an attempted goal in the 67th minute, but offsides was called. Disciplinary report, PM Ka has one caution away from a suspension. Disabled list is none, and conference standing is number six in the Western Conference. Seattle Sounders, on the other hand, an exhausted Seattle Sounders tied 1-1 one to -one with San Jose Quakes this past Wednesday after completing their fifth game in 19 days. Notably missing from the first half of the game was forward Clint Dempsey. However, Obafemi Martins and Chad Barrett kept San Jose on their toes with Barrett making a goal at the beginning of the first half in the 45th minute. But it was San Jose's Wondolowski who tied up the game in the 64th minute. Disciplinary report, Pineda with one caution away, and so is Yedlin. Disabled list, defense, Damian Lowe with a left hip injury. Forward, Kevin Parsmain with an ACL tear. Defense, Dylan Remick with a left adductor strain. They are currently number one in the Western Conference. So this will be the sixth game in a row for the 20, within 20 days for the Seattle Sounders. I'm not exactly sure why the MLS schedules these things, uh, but it does the team nor the players any good. When you compare it to the English Premier League, they have a very set schedule of weekly games. Now, granted, England is small enough where they aren't constantly getting on and off airplanes flying coast to coast for hours, but it just seems that the this schedule of six games in 20 days is, is fraught with opportunities for injury and exhaustion. So even though the Portland Timbers are currently ranked number sixth in the Western Conference, we have seen that they do beat the, uh, the Timbers the, the, I'm sorry, the Seattle Sounders, and uh, that is why I think the, this is where they're going to slip up, the Seattle Sounders. I think a lot will depend on if Dempsey will play the full, the full game or just wait until the second half like he did in this past game. My final score here is a surprising 2-0. to zero. Hey, listen, don't forget to click that button and subscribe. Comment, like, share. I want to hear from you as we do all of these. It is hard work, so I do want to make sure that there is an audience out there. Obviously, it's growing, but we need to grow it faster. Don't forget about the cleats giveaway and the weekly uh, giveaway. For those, I am choosing one ML, two MLS and two EPL games. I will predict the the player in that game who will score the first goal overall. And if I am correct, we will give away a jersey. You need to follow us on Twitter, and we will put that in the notes, the link over to our Twitter account, and then retweet once you see that message. So, ole, ole, ole. Have a safe and happy week. Have fun with soccer. Cheers. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.